And what we see in this type of lymphoma is a dichotomy of the end outcome. So essentially about 60% of the patients are cured with ARCHOP chemotherapy. However, about 40% of the patients will not be cured. And those patients will relapse typically very soon after induction chemotherapy, typically within two years. And the majority of those patients, unfortunately, will succumb to the disease despite recent progress in the treatment of patients with relapsed refractory uh, diffuse large PCL lymphoma. Um, if you look at the proportion of patients which are relapsing with high IPI, high risk, it's even higher. Um, uh, therefore, there is still a met need of improving frontline therapy in diffuse large PCL lymphoma and building on the backbone of ARCHOP uh, to improve the results of uh, frontline therapy. Uh, obviously, in the lapse refractory space, there's also a need to improve the treatments there. And there has been some progress with recent approval of anti c 19 antibody, tefacidumab, uh, car T cells, and uh, bortuzumab, adultin. Uh, those are all recently approved and are active in this space. Uh, however, um, majority of the patients, unfortunately, will still succumb to the disease with relapse and refractory disease. So still unmet need there. 